Hello friends, I am Kausik and you are watching tutorials in English literature. In today's lesson, I am going to introduce you to the characters of William Congreve's famous creation, The Way of the World. The first thing that I want to mention here is that the names of the characters are very important as the names are indicative of the nature of the characters as we find in the comedy of humors of Ben Johnson. The first character of our discussion is Mirabel, Edward Mirabel. Mirabel is the protagonist of the play. He is an intellectual, smart, fashionable man of the town. He is very popular among the ladies and he has broken hearts of many women by not returning their love. Before the play begins, Mirabel had an affair with Mrs. Fenner. But when the play opens, we find that Mirabel deeply loves Milamit. Mirabel is very different from the rakish, rake hell hero that we find in earlier restoration comedies of manners written by George Ithach and William Wycherley. He is witty, but he is at the same time a gentleman. He has grace and decorum. So he is a true wit. His name Mirabel signifies that he is admirable. And it also suggests that Mirabel admires beauty. Mirabel admires female beauty. The next character of our discussion is Mr. Fainal. Mr. Fennell is the antagonist of the play. He had an affair with Mrs. Maru and for that reason he hates his wife Mrs. Fennell. Mrs. Fennell does not know anything about his relationship with Mrs. Maru. Mr. Fennell is sneaky, insecure and treacherous. He is also very cruel. His name, Fainer, suggests that he feigns always. That means he always pretends. He is a great hypocrite. We shall continue our discussion with the character of Mrs. Marwood. Mrs. Marwood is the lover, the paramour of Mr. Fainer. She is also the best friend of Lady Whisford and a friend of Mrs. Fainer. Mrs. Marwood is an adept liar, treacherous and very cunning woman. Mrs. Marwood also loves Mirabel. But in the play, she realizes that Mirabel does not love her, rather Mirabel loves Milament and that enrages her. He, uh, that means Mr. Fennell and Mrs. Marut plan to disinherit Milament from her dowry. Mrs. Fennell from her property and even Mrs. Wishford, Lady Wishford from her entire fortune. Her name Marut suggests that she would mar, that means she would harm everybody. Her name is really apt for her nature. After that, I shall discuss the character of Lady Whisford. Lady Whisford is a rich, wealthy, old widow. She is mother of Mrs. Fennell and she is aunt of Sir Wilful and Whitwood. She is also the guardian of Lady Whisford, uh, sorry, guardian of Milamant. She is vain and silly and she pretends to be young and that is why she makes herself fool now and then. Lady Whisford's name suggests that she always wishes for something which she cannot achieve. In her case, beauty youth and lover. Her name Wishford is a contraction of wish for it. 
The next character I shall discuss is Milamant. Milamant is the heroine of the play. She is rich, beautiful, and she can have any man she desires, and she knows it. In the play, we find that she is cruel and attentive to Mirabel. But Milamant really loves Mirabel deeply. But she likes to make Mirabel jealous, and so. She spent a lot of time with Petulan and Wetut. She is an independent, an, an independent woman and she loves poetry. In the Proviso scene, we find that she gives condition to Mirabel before her marriage to keep intact her independence and Mirabel just giving some few conditions except her all provisos ready. Her name Milament indicates that she has thousand lovers. And in the play, Mirabel Armasing and also Witwood and Petulant quote her. And Sad Willful also quote her. The next character of our discussion is Sad Willful. Sir Wilful is nephew of Lady Wishfort. She is cousin of Mrs. Fennel, Milamant, and she and he is the half brother of Witwood. Sir Wilful is a country bumpkin, a man of the countryside, and so he is ignorant and he is unrefined. He is unaware about the etiquettes, the polished behavior of the high fashionable society of London. But he is very sweet and good humored. Sir Wilful is also protective of Mrs. Fennel and he is even ready to fight with Fennel. Sir Wilful also is very loyal to Mirabel. Sir Wilful comes to London because he wants to learn French and he has planned to visit France to improve his own nature. After that, I shall discuss Sir Wilful's half-brother, Witwood. Witwood is a fop, a fashionable dandy in the place. He once lived with his brother in the countryside, but now he has in London and he has been working as a clerk. He works in the play as a mouthpiece for her best friend, Petulant often supplying him with the vocabulary and interpreting his nonsense that Petulant often spouts. Witwood is not as foolish as Petulant, though he may not be as witty as Mirabel. Witwood has idea, Witwood has knowledge of Mr. Fennel's affair with Mrs. Manut. His name suggests that he is going to be a witch, he who wants to be a witch. That was a trend, popular trend of restoration London society. After that, I shall discuss the character of Petulant. Petulant is a boisterous, naughty young fellow who is really a fashionable fool, a popish character. Petulant is always ready to have an argument without any substantial point, and he is a speaker of a garbage, of nonsense. Petulant quotes Milament because it is the fashion of the time. He does not love Milament. Petulant also always wants to show him as a man popular with ladies. And for that reason, Petulant hires actors and he goes out with them to show that the actors are actually admirers of him. Petulant's name suggests that he is really a petulant, a foolish, angry man. After that, I shall discuss the character of Firebull. Firebull is Lady Whisper's servant. Once probably she was penniless, homeless, beggar, and Lady Whisper saved her from the road and gave her job. Firebull is very clever and she is very smart and for that reason Mirabel likes him, likes her and give her some special duties. 
Fireball is the only character in the play who is aware and who sympathizes with Mrs. Penner's heartbreak. Mrs. Penner's pains agony when she helps Mirabel to win Milamet. Fireball in the play marries Whitewell who is Mirabel's servant. So now I shall discuss the character of wait well. Wait well name suggests that he can wait well and in the play he plays the role of Sir Roland who is the fictitious uncle of Mirabel. Wait well is not as clever as his wife Firewall but he plays the role of Roland very well and wait well now just married is very uh, hungry to sleep with his wife throughout the play. So these are the main characters of William Conrips, the way of the world. Now I want to show a character map so that you can understand more in more detail the intricate relationship of these characters. This is the character map of way of the world. So you will find here two centers. The first one is Lady Wisford and second one is our protagonist Mirabel. So in the character map I have used arrows to suggest the relationship between these characters. You will find here two green arrows. These two green arrows suggest a true relationship. There are some red arrows. I have used red arrows to indicate blood relationships and the other arrows indicate the false relationship, the social facet that has been maintained by the characters. So let's begin our discussion here. First we find that Mirabel is loved by Mrs. Marut. But this love is not written by Mirabel, and so I have used their black arrow. You will also find that Lady Wisford, Lady Wisford loves Mirabel, though now she hates Mirabel. You will also find that Mrs. Fennel, Mrs. Fennel has attraction for Mirabel, and it's a true relationship. They were lovers before the play begins and now they are true friends. And the other true relationship is the love between Mirabel and Milamant. So it has been shown through the green arrow. Apart from that, there are other relationships. For example, Mrs. Marut. Mrs. Marut is the paramour of Mr. Fennel, lover of Mr. Fennel and it is an extramarital affair. Mrs. Marwood also describes herself as the best friend of Lady Wisford. Though she does not trust Lady Wisford and she is ready to harm her. She is ready to disinherit Lady Wisford from her entire property. Mrs. Marwood is also a friend of Mrs. Fennel, but they are also not true friends. They also suspect each other. So, Mrs. Marut is very important character who professes to be a friend of Lady Wisport, but at the same time, she keeps an affair with a man who is the husband of her best friend daughter, Mrs. Fennel. And Mrs. Maru also loves Mirabel. Okay, so now looks at two nephews of Lady Wisford. First one is Sir Wilful, and second one is Witwood. So Sir Wilful and Witwood, they are nephews of Lady Wisford, and they are cousin of Mrs. Fennel and Milamant. Sir Wilful's half brother is Witwood, half brother. And Petulant is the friend of Witwood. 
and at the end of the play petulant also becomes a friend of sad willful when we told and petulant become angry to visit france with sad willful the other character that we find here the two servants one is lady who is for servants fable and mirabel servant waiter mirabel has planned their marriage because it's the first step of his plot to blackmail lady wisfort so that she becomes agree in mirabel's marriage with milament okay so mirabel has planned to wait to uh, to present wait well in the disguise of sir roland as his fictitious uncle and this role is played by waitwell and waitwell quotes lady wisfort as sir roland so that mirabel can blackmail lady wisfort and lady wisfort at last agrees to give her consent to milament to marry mirabel so this is their plan so we we can find here that there are lots of false relationship okay for example the friendship between mrs penol and mrs marwood friendship between mrs marwood and lady wisfort the husband wife relationship between mr penol and mrs penol and the way the three characters coat milament are also nothing but a social facade so this is the intricate and complex relationships between the characters of way of the world now i believe that you all are able to realize to grasp the intricate relationships chemistry between each characters so if you like this video please give a thumbs up and share this video with your friends and families and if you are interested in english literature i humbly request you to subscribe to this channel that's all for today thank you for watching